when India started to chase those 179, they were in control throughout the innings. Shubhan Gill was outstanding with his short selection and Yashashvi Jaiswal yet another time he showed that how good a player he is. He's probably a player of all formats. He got a 100 on test debut. He's just playing his second T20I and got a proper 50 today. So I think you know, the way India you know, chased down this target, the way India actually approached this game, when you score more than 150 as an opening partnership, that 179 target looks really small. And India, exactly what India did today. I thought India was outstanding today. You know, this is something... We all want to see how Indian cricket goes forward. You know, the way Ashdib attacked, the way Kuldeep attacked in their mindset, the way Yashashvi Jaiswal and Shopan Gill came in, the way they batted. You know, there was no fear and that's how the world cricket is evolving. And that's how we want to see how Indian cricket goes. I thought Shopan Gill was outstanding today. You know, someone, we know the potential of Shopan Gill. We have the tendency of you know questioning someone who doesn't get runs and we say whether is good enough for a T20 format or not. Not Then we've seen how good Shubhan Gil is. So just a couple of performances here and there just doesn't... We should not just say, you know, he can't play T20 or one-day cricket. Shubhan Gil is once again, like Yashashwi Jaiswal, is a player for future. And he showed that again today. We need to keep faith in players. We need to keep faith in an approach. Because when you're trying to play an attacking cricket you might get out, especially an opener playing in T20 format. So, keeping faith is something which Indian cricket needs to do it going forward, especially in this format.